Hey guys, Vegan Cyclist here. So I want to talk a little bit about dinner, right? Dinner is super awesome, super important. Uh, for me, it's what I look forward to pretty much the whole day. I can't wait for dinner. As a vegan athlete, usually my dinner is big. It is a lot of food. Um, if I'm, you know, training really hard or if I've done a really big race, like this last weekend I did a stage race. So my dinners have just been massive, uh, trying to replenish the body with a lot of calories and a lot of good nutrients. So I kind of just want to go through pretty much uh, my basic dinner, you know, the, the standardized dinner that I do um, every night and uh, kind of show you how I prepare it and what I do. So I uh, eat a lot of different things for dinner, a lot of different variety, but pretty much uh, my dinners are going to consist of the same components, um, just kind of prepared in different ways. Potatoes are my go to food. I freaking love potatoes. Um, so I oil them up and... Uh, mix them up with some onions, put them on a cookie sheet, um, put a lot of salt and seasoning on them, some like onion powder and, uh, and chili powder and that sort of thing. And you can just dump them in the oven for like, you know, 30 minutes um, to 45 minutes at about 375 to 425. And they're super low maintenance because if you kind of forget that they're there, um, it's not, you know, it's not a huge deal. You can kind of get away with like 10 to 20 minutes either way and they're still going to be really good so while those are in the oven i'm usually prepping my veggies um, sometimes it's broccoli and zucchini and squash um, other times it's asparagus you know or cauliflower um, but uh, but usually i'm going to do onions and mushrooms and bell peppers almost you know every night if i can just to, i mean i just really like variety i like to have a bunch of different veggies um, for dinner and just kind of mix it all together. I like the, the synergy almost of, of all the veggies together. So um, the way that I cook them is with my skillet pan. I really like my, my skillet, um, my iron skillet. And then I've got the stainless steels that uh, are a little bit more maintenance. But so what I'll do is put some uh, oil, uh, usually use coconut oil, and um, I salt them and that's it. You know, I just kind of stir fry them around a little bit I try not to cook them too long, um, so I'm not trying to like burn them or crisp them or anything like that, but uh, they come out really, really good. Um, the broccoli is so delicious, just lightly salted and, uh, you know, cooked in some oil. So then I kind of mix everything together, um, you know, get them plated up and ready for the family. Um, again, the potatoes are just, I mean, I'll, I'll eat so much potatoes. Uh, salad. Sometimes I'll eat the salad before dinner, you know, if like I'm uh, still waiting on the potatoes to get done, I'll just snarf this down with some chia seeds, some olive oil, some raw onions. Freaking love raw onions and salads. Delicious. So, uh, got the spinach. Really, really good. Um, get this thing all plated up and, I mean, I just go to town. And since there's really not this huge piece of, of meat on my plate, you know, there's nothing like really high that's uh, that's calorically dense. Um, I'm just able to consume my face off and just keep eating, keep eating until like my stomach's just like no more, you know, because I've got so much food on my plate. So it's super delicious. Um, I, it's this type of food, uh, and but in different variations. So sometimes I'll do different types of potatoes, uh, you know, or cook my veggies in a different way. But so I mean, this is it. This is what a vegan cyclist eats for dinner. Awesome, guys. Hey, thank you so much for checking this out. Let me know what you guys do for dinner. I'm always open to uh, new ideas, and it's kind of weird how I go through some trends of where I'll be really into one thing, uh, you know, for a couple weeks and then completely change and go somewhere else. So um, I really appreciate it. Like, subscribe, share this, and uh, thanks for watching.